Yes. Well, there are all sorts of rumors. There's rumors that there's going to be a vortex in space and that this will affect people. It will affect them, uh, make them nervous, make them, uh, uh, what shall I say, jittery, that it will have some effect on them. But of course, you know, many things have been predicted, but it doesn't mean that they occur. It may occur and it may not occur. What's your feeling about it? I'm really open on it. There will be mass illumination, <laughs> mass masses of people having that understanding and being able to live by it. On August 16th and 17th, 144,000 people plus will come together in sacred sites across the world and they will think one thought. They will think peace. These people that will come together have already found peace within. Ellen and David have found that peace. They use it in their Tantra sex therapy. May you be happy. May you be happy. <laughs> That's one. And then just the head to head. No, I don't like the head to head that much. Oh, okay. Well, let's go back to that one again. Let's do that one. You want to feel the hand, feel the... Uh, okay. Yeah, a little hard to like, okay. And breathe together. Look in each other's eyes, or sometimes it's easier. You can either look in the forehead or in the person's uh, left eye. And you breathe together. And it just takes time, you know, where the body just sort of settles down. And what happens is you start to experience that there's a one body here, there's not two bodies. And you can actually make love in this way. And then what people call physical sex is a stepped down version of that uh, using the more grosser stimuli. This isn't the 60s. It, it's a little bit of the 60s and a lot of the 80s and more of the 2000s mm -hmm. and the 3000s to come. And it, it isn't ungrounded. It isn't just emotional. It really permeates all levels of consciousness right now. The mass consciousness is shifting. Right. Being together, we're, we're functioning at the same pitch, at the same tone. And that's not something you have to believe in. I, I'm a real cynic in many ways, but when I resonate, I don't have to ask any questions. I know I am resonating together. Raphael, who's going to believe anybody who has sticks coming out of their hair?